Go to the scapular plane. And the scapular plane would be when I raise the arm up this way. About 30 degrees. It gives me the scapular plane in relation to control the arm to the scapula. Now I'm going to stand in this position here and use my leg to keep him in this position. I'm going to take my forearm, lock his arm down. You gotta get closer to the mosh pit, right? Mosh. And you, when you turn your leg. I'm gonna grab the tissues, and normally you wouldn't have clothes on, you know, shirt on. And you would take tissue pull, joint slack, impulse for compression. Where are you going? Are you going into I'm going the straight in, yeah, into the yeah. Into it. Yeah. Well, again, tissue pull, joint slack, and I'm locking him down here, keeping him at the third degree scapula. Can you do it on Mark? Because we can't exactly see what you're doing. What, what's the name of this yeah. movement? Which one? Or or what? <laughs> Which one is this one? Because I can't, can't see what you put his knee on. The placement of where it's in the mosh pit. Rehack. Put it right in his mosh pit. His arm is here. Anybody have a towel? I'm going to grab here, right? You know, I'm going to take tissue pull this way. Tissue pull, joint slack, impulse. Right? What do you want to do now? No, because I'm Well, you're taking tissue pull down yeah. into the shirt. Right. Tissue yeah. pull, joint slack, impulse. Bless you. Bless you. What is this one called? Lateral medial? Yeah. What is this called? That was called. That was called. Lateral medial. Compression of the GH in the scapular plane, 30 degrees. Yeah. Uh, now we're going to do distraction of the sure. GH in the scapular plane, 30 degrees. So everything looks the same, turn your head away. Nothing has changed. Now I grab closer to the again, towards the mosh pit area. I'm going to take tissue pull, joint slack, impulse. Right? The short impulse. Right, then I can. Why don't you try those two? Try those two. Mm -hmm. Impression distraction.